from Design World, and I'm here at Cedar Point with Monty Jasper, the Corporate Vice President of Safety and Engineering for Cedar Fair. We're here at the uh, Wicked Twister, and Monty's going to tell us a little bit about the technology that is used to launch this train up and up around the tracks. Wicked Twister is a very interesting ride because it uses uh, linear induction motors to do a horizontal launch, it's something that you don't see often on, on uh, coasters. Uh, a linear induction motor is just a series of coils that are uh, set on right and left sides of the track with a gap between them. Once you power them, they, those coils will set up a magnetic field that uh, certain metals don't like to be in the middle of. The train under, mounted underneath it on the track has, uh, has aluminum alloy fins underneath it that are on top of it that are between those uh, magnetic coils. So when the linear induction motors fire and they set up that magnetic field, those, those fins and the train underneath it don't want to be there. They jump out of the way. So you have the, the possibility with a whole bunch of linear induction motors down the track to essentially fire them in sequence and move the train down the track as you would launch. In this particular ride, we do that uh, in such a way that you gain speed from about zero to 55 miles an hour on the first pass. And then we reverse it coming backwards and fire them in the opposite direction so we can get up to 70 miles an hour. It's a great ride. It's a good experience. Why did you go with uh, linear induction motors on this ride? Well, it, uh, linear induction motors uh, give us this experience of a horizontal launch, and there are very few technologies that can do that. Um, uh, you know, the Navy uses steam catapults to launch airplanes, uh, but in this case, we chose electrical uh, because of its innovation and, the, and you know, there's something that we can market. Uh, it has a high electrical inrush, but it doesn't use a lot of electrical power, and it doesn't have a lot of wear and tear. So it's an interesting experience, a good marketing tool, and a, a neat ride. Uh, since this is something unusual, is designing and maintaining this ride a little more tougher of a challenge for you? Uh, it, is, it is a very complicated ride. It has a lot of computer controls. We're obviously firing uh, linear induction motors with a lot of power in certain sequences to move the trains around. If that's not all done correctly, then the ride doesn't run right. It's uh, very difficult for and, and takes a lot of, of uh, expertise to maintain this ride. Thank you so much.